breaking news at Westfield State University this morning. The school's board of trustees has reached a temporary decision in the spending controversy surrounding the school president. Point News reporter Nicole Delep is live outside Westfield State this morning to explain. After being in a 10-hour closed-door meeting, the Westfield State University board of trustees decided to place President Evan Dobell on paid administrative leave. WSU board of chair Jack Flynn announced that they decided to hire a Boston-based law firm called Fish and Richardson to conduct an investigation into President Dobell's spending and any issues that were raised by the Inspector General. The deadline for that investigation is November 25th, and President Dobell will remain on paid administrative leave until then. 22 News caught up with WSU's president shortly after the announcement was made. I wish I could uh, speak to you, uh, uh, but the reality is I can't. Uh, we worked very hard uh, tonight uh, to try to give uh, folks uh, various paths out, uh, and uh, my attorney can speak uh, to that directly. Dobell's attorney, Ross Garber, says that they're contemplating legal action and looking at all options over the next few days. Live at Westfield State University, Nicole Nalepa, 22 News.